What's up, FishTankTV.com and YouTube. Just got home from the pet store. I uh, went two days in a row because my girlfriend needed a... Uh, her filter broke on her. We got her nice Aquion. Not as good as the Marineland Bio Wheel, but uh, it does the job. And uh, went to the pet store and it's probably been seen yesterday because I would got a female too. Dustin, my man, you'd be proud. Shane, you'd be proud too. Well, you're more of a stickler guy, but uh, I got my first rainbow. It's the Parkox male rainbow. There's two left in there, and uh, the, the the dominant male is picking on the male because you know you need a girl one to a male to female ratio. So I got the smaller male, so he didn't get harassed, and his colors are phenomenal. And they haven't he hasn't even been fed up yet. Once he gets in that sunlight, man, Dustin, I see what you mean. It's, camera doesn't do justice to these fish when uh when they get in the sunlight you see purples blues greens it's amazing so we're gonna get him up in here um the ph is right for him in here it wouldn't be in any other tank uh he gets three inches and i ordered him a female i don't know when his she'll be in and i also ordered two bosmanis now am i gonna keep rainbows in here forever hell no I might set up another tank. But that's, uh, that's a different story. And you can see he's still small. He's got plenty of room in this tank for now. And uh, I just won't do as many water. I mean, I'm going to keep my nitrates down and stuff. Um, but I'm just kind of going to do as many water changes because I know Dustin said a lot of water changes will just they'll just make him grow insane. And this bait has never been with another fish except for his own brother. So we'll see what happens. And uh, yeah, he's got my first rainbow, and I'm excited. I saw him in the store, and I was like, cool, a rainbow. I've never seen one in here before. They had him in there before, but i never seen him. And uh, I kept watching him. He got in the right light condition, and you see those purples and blues on him. I was like, oh, my God, that's beautiful. Just had to get him, and I'm really happy about it. My first rainbow. Uh, definitely going to talk to Dustin about this a little. Uh, if I run into any problems with the rainbows, but I'm sure I'll be able to take, take care of it. And... Uh, yeah, it's just an amazing fish. Can't wait until I get my female and my Bozmanis. Later, guys. So that's what's up. He's in there. And he's doing fine. You can see the Wailichi, too, is growing, too. I put that in there recently, and it's doing good. You can see a snail on there. These are trimmings for my Wailichi. I'm about to do a trimming on my 10-gallon uh, uh, Serpe Central, uh, yeah, Serpe Central tank because... I just did a water change and the plants have grown insane. So I've got to get myself a female parkox and I got two little Bozmanis, a male and female I just ordered, so that'll complete this tank and when they get a little bigger we can uh we'll do something else with them. But right now that size is fine in here. I mean, this bait is like three inches, so uh four fish the size of him in here aren't gonna hurt it. So uh, as long as I keep up with the water changes and stuff, and if uh, all the plants and stuff, I just my, I just play, paid for another plant order, and I've got some amazing plants coming in, and uh, I mean that should keep the nitrates down too, and I'm gonna do some trimming. I might some I might put some plants in here. Who knows? So comment, rate, subscribe. Tell me what you think. Later. I also want to show you at the time uh, the new fish I got yesterday, the royal the clown pleco. And uh, the, the clown Pocosmus, if you don't know what Pleco is, but you should. But uh, he's right in front of your face. You probably don't even see him. There he is right here. He's got some amazing camouflage. Now, I apologize for the, the light quality on this uh, camera for this tank. It's just so much light on this tank. It never picks it up. The tank is not this green. It is not that yellow. It is actually crystal clear. It is just the light. Uh, it's so bright. It's it's making everything look green because the light's bouncing off all the green, I guess. But here's the Royal Pleco, and this guy, he uh, he doesn't get much bigger than that. They get about that big, fully grown. And uh, I got him to take care of the algae problem up on the, in his tank because you can see I got some little hair out. I mean, the hair algae. Uh, I just got slime algae on the glass and stuff. And instead of me cleaning it, he can do it for me, and he's eating too. So it's a win-win situation for both of us. And he's got a nice home, and you can see he's. He's resting on that lily right now, and uh, I'm about to do a water change on this thing, guys, and all I really do is siphon it into a bucket or my gas can, and that's what's going on, guys. Later. Oh, 
little dudes eating my snails. <laughs> well, I mean, go for it. <laughs> Look at the colors. I'm telling you, if you get new life spectrum, I will show you a picture of this beta if I can find it on my computer what he originally looked like. And I will show you how much I fed him up. I just, oh, I just can't wait to get those Bose monies. They're gonna look amazing. You see, I'm glad. I got a daylight bulb and a plant bulb, and a daylight makes the Bose monies look good, and this plant bulb is making him look good. So, uh, it's a win-win situation.